Today, three of us, myself, my wife, and our dog, BB, are on a mission to buy the world's best bread. Yeah, some of you may know, um, I'm into trying to keep my health together and at my age and eating well or eating good food is vital to me. So we have discovered, or not discovered, but we found um, some really, really nice bread. It's brown sourdough, wholemeal sourdough, nothing in it, no, add no additives, and very hard to find. There's no bakers, there's only one bakers I found in Gloucestershire that make it. You cannot buy it in the supermarket, you cannot buy it in what they call artisan bakers in various places. There are some shops, but it's, uh, they sell the bread from the bakery we're going to. So there's one in Sarcester, there's one in Stroud, uh, it's Hall's Bakery. And um, I don't think there's one in Cheltenham. You cannot buy good bread in Cheltenham. There's an artisan baker's, but they don't sell it. They only sell white sourdough. Um, white sourdough is just as bad as white anything else. Um, you need to buy brown whole meal bread. That is the most important thing. But sourdough also is extremely good for your stomach, your gut health. That's why we go and buy it. So normally we order it and drive over. Today the weather is beautiful. Spring is in the air, or should I say summer almost. It's fresh. We've almost had a frost, but the weather's looking really, really nice. So come along with us. We're taking um, our dog with us today. It's a dead pan flat route. I think the most climbing we do over the whole route there is 350 feet. So it's canal all the way to the bakery. And um, yeah, if you want to just It'll be a short video, it's not very long, um, but uh, yeah, come along, see how we get on, and see what all the fuss is about. All right, catch you in a bit. You all right in there? Settled in? <laughs> Wonder where we're going? <laughs> on a mission. Ready? What a beautiful morning. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> Couldn't wish for better, really. beautiful boats along here at the moment. I ride this, I feature this canal quite a lot in my videos for obvious reasons. It's just a route to places. Today is just all canal. So it's a dead pan flat ride. I just thought we've got to fetch some, uh, got to find this bread. So we thought why not make a day of it. Take Pooch out on the bike and enjoy this lovely day. So is that. It's a house. Coming up to the pilot pub.
believe just how perfect it is. Still, there's no wind today. We've had nothing but wind for weeks and weeks, but today it's as still as anything. Quite warm now. It's supposed to be 12 degrees, but it feels a lot more than that in the sun. Just coming up to Saul Junction now. Which is like a bit of a crossroads. We're going to turn when we get to the swing bridge. We'll be turning left out, out towards the Stroud Canal. It's quite a busy spot. This. And hopefully, we can get a cup of coffee and maybe a piece of cake. We'll see. Yeah, I did say cake. <laughs> I haven't had any sugar in so long. I'll see. I'll see what they've got. <laughs> Great. The the yeah. Great minds think alike. I never saw him in the back. Yeah. That's quality, isn't it? <laughs> through a place called Whitminster. We should join up with the Stroud Canal soon. There's a new section there. Basically joining re um oh yeah. They're redoing the canal, cleaning it out, restoring it. It's taking a lot of money, millions of pounds, but hopefully one day it'll all be back. The section where we've just been in Saul Junction should connect up with Stroud Canal where we'll go up to in a minute. They put a, uh, a section in one than the roundabout, which um, is pretty impressive. Yeah, today's ride is just a day out in the sun. Days like this, you've just got to grab if you can. Just take it and enjoy it. Leisurely pace, no racing. Just taking our time, stopping when we feel like it. Had a little chat with someone who's uh, he looked without being disrespectful. He didn't look like a cyclist. He sat on a bench as we went by. And turns out he's been everywhere and a lot of cycling. He just happened to be dressed in normal clothes, you know, so he didn't look like a cyclist. Yeah, we got chatting to him. And he'd cycled all over the place. Walked as well, done a lot of hiking and stuff, so looks are can be dece deceiving as they say. <laughs> yeah, nice chap. He was on his way down to Sharpness Canal just for a ride, a bit like ourselves. Just taking it in, look at it. Yeah, we had a coffee and a pasty. Didn't have a cake. <laughs> Sticking to my no sugar. Should join up with the canal again soon. By the way, I am not riding a smokestone today. I'm riding my Salsa Black Barrel cargo bike, which we've put the box on the back for the dog, for BB. And uh, I had thought about making my own cargo bike, but I don't really see the point, to be honest, when I've got this one. So, uh, 
Sheena made a bag for it, frame bag. I'm running um, fat bike wheels on it, because it is obviously it's a fat bike. It's got 20, uh, 26 by 4 inch tyres on it, so jumbo gyms, which are the fastest rolling fat bike tyre you can get, really. Super lightweight, so it rolls along nicely. No real difference. She was on a 29er with 2.6 tyres. She's on a smokestone, Mr. Harry. Doing our work on the canal. Oh, voluntary. Gives all the retired people something to do, eh? <laughs> This is the Stroud Canal now, this is sort of the other end, this is the bit that will join up to where we were earlier. Straight on! I love this section because you get so much wildlife along here, different birds, quite a few ducks and geese, there'll be some swans I expect shortly. The canal so high, <laughs> it's almost coming over. It's almost coming over, isn't it? They've done so much work on this part of the canal. Junction 6.4k, small bridge 4k. Yeah, we go off the canal soon onto the onto that track I was on about. No. Oh, I know. Look at that for a picture. <laughs> you got to get a picture of that. <sighs> Cheers, mate. Thank you. Oh yeah. River through, and that's the Stroke Canal. Some more there. Oh, the ducks have hatched already. Tiny little things. They must have hatched just yesterday, I'd say. If you don't like canals, this video, this video is no good for you because <laughs> it's just canal all the way and all the way back. I won't film on the way back. Not a lot of point, but uh, I just wanted to get capture this beautiful beautiful day really and show you just what the hell we're doing and where we're going and why we're going that snow business in there that's the people that make all the snow for all the big Hollywood movies and everything you can think of They're behind these houses oh, it's just Ebley now I think I've mentioned before I did all the groundworks on these houses here. This used to be a bog, 
and we spent about a month filling it in with soil to build it up to build houses on. Ah, yeah, guess we gotta go over here. This is why I didn't show it as a cycleway. Yeah, you might have to take the front. This is when you don't want a wide bike. things you have to do. Ole, 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 ole. Ole, ole. <laughs> hey? We're now on the old railway that goes up to Nailsworth. I must say straight, it's got so many network of old railway lines which have now been turned into cycleways. You can go all over the place. Relatively no hills. That must be Aldi there. Yeah, it is. It's gone through Woodchester. Under the uh, main road now. Stroud to Nailsworth Road, 846. place to get your bread. There it is. <laughs> that was a bit quiet. Sorry. <laughs> They're there for you, I'll go and take them. Okay. Lovely, yeah. The smell in here is um, amazing. <laughs> Bread baking. That's what all the fuss was about. Right, mission accomplished. We have the bread. <laughs> Back home. Oh, just on our way back there. Eh? We're about halfway, oh, more than halfway back, past uh, Saw Junction on Gloucester Sharpness Canal. It's got a little bit cooler, the sun's gone in there, but uh, still a great ride. And we managed to get our bread 
so the mission is successful <laughs> I'll tell you about the bread in a minute to, and why we travel so far to get it right we are back and why did we go we went to get this this is the finest <laughs> wholemeal sourdough bread which is really hard to find there's nothing in it that shouldn't be it's all natural stuff and it's really really good for you a lot of people don't eat bread anymore um, and basically it's because of the stuff that's in bread upsets your stomach I've been the victim of that it's terrible there's so much rubbish in normal bread and white bread is really bad for you um, you shouldn't eat white anything but, um, but I, no, I shouldn't tell you that I should <laughs> I shouldn't say you shouldn't do something what I should say is brown is better because it's full of everything it's got all the nutrients that you need which is much better for you so if I was looking to buy bread I would always buy brown as I have just done right we've just finished the route it's 40 miles really nice day out a nice tailwind back up the canal and um, yeah time for a cup of tea and a slice of bread. 